This is the GPS level line meter and it's ideal if you have a large fleet of loggers deployed in the field. Now on the screen you can see that we are recording the barometric pressure. That is coming from the barometric sensor which is built into the level line meter. Then we can see the temperature and also the level. These are being generated from the level line itself. We have an option to zero the depth by pressing the OK button in a much similar way to the quick deploy key in the way that that would zero the pressure. We can then scroll from left to right to view the probe status giving us information on the probe's memory and also the battery status and also the lat long positions that are recorded by the GPS meter. If we go into the menu we can see we have various options. We have probe deployment, memory utilities and probe and meter setup. Now if we go into the probe deployment section here we can set up rating events, we can set up IDs and positioning, start durations and we can also control logging now live on the meter uh, in this section. In the memory utilities we have the option to clear the memory of the meter and of the probe and also in the probe and meter setup we have the option here to set up the meter and basically set up units and this kind of thing. Now one of the key features of the GPS meter is the ability to embed your level line with its GPS coordinates. This is really useful if you have a fleet of level lines deployed and you want to know exactly where each one was from. To do this we enter the menu, we go to probe deployment and we go to set ID and position. Set ID allows us to type in a name of the location, pressing the view and sync position will also allow us to sync the GPS coordinates that have been recorded by the meter and embed them into the probe. Finally, not only does the meter allow you to completely set up the level line and do everything that you can do on a PC, it also allows you to download data from multiple level lines. In fact, you can store 1.5 million data points on one of these meters. That's the equivalent of 300 level lines worth of data.